When I was in my mid-twenties, I started having experiences which caused me to realize there were other um, forms of energies and intelligences that are not just what we observe as like hu uh, humans or animals or um, reptiles or things like that. That there are actually um, ethereal beings that exist that occasionally grace us with their presence and these beings are angels. Uh, like I said, being an atheist, I was certainly not looking for angels or believing in them. But one day I was with a friend and um, he felt that I had a lot of insight about some of his issues so we were talking and I was trying to really tune into what was going on with him and, and he said, oh I feel so alone. And then behind him I suddenly saw a golden light being standing right behind him. And this is my first encounter with an angel and I said, well you're not alone. And then all evening, this golden light being was just like flashing around the room. It was very magical. And I went to an art store. I bought some gold leaf and did my first angel painting. And what really amazed me when I did it, I remember um, I had this horrible, horrible pain in my spine. And had, I had the worst headache I ever had in my life when I did the painting. I did it all in one day. Um, it was like something that had been trapped and closed up in me was just like being like opened up, you know, to pull through the energy of this painting. And there was on this canvas this gold leaf shiny angel, and uh, I thought, wow, it really captured the energy of what I had seen standing behind my friend. And that's what got me going from New York realist to angel painter and beyond.